VPs, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know, I'm Von Sill. This is Von Sill TV. If you have not subscribed yet, make sure you go ahead and you take out the time to subscribe. Now, I'm coming to y'all this week for story time week, which is gonna be, it was on Monday, here it is Wednesday, and there will be one more this week after today, and that'll be on Friday. And I'm doing a collab with my girl, Miss AC, so make sure you run over there, you watch her story time as well, and make sure that you tell her that I sent y'all, okay? Make sure you do that. All right, so, today's story time, <laughs> oh my god this is crazy all right i talked in my last story time about when i decided to get well when i decided to move to dallas the way that i just packed up packed my shit i was a single mom i moved to dallas i was making good money me and my two kids were able to just go and just do whatever we wanted like no issues no problems what have you okay so my daughter candace candace might have been probably about 10 something like that okay around this time maybe about nine ten uh, ten years old about probably nine okay anyways somewhere up around that age okay so candace wanted a pet now Candace likes cats. I'm sorry, y'all. If you're a cat lover, I do apologize for turning up my face, but I do not like cats, okay? As a matter of fact, I'm scared of cats. But I, I love pit bulls. That's another story. <laughs> so, anyways... I sure as hell wasn't fixing to get her no cat, okay? We we tried that. Like, she wanted a cat before, and I got this little kitten for her, and I couldn't sleep at night. Like, at first it was okay. As long as that kitten couldn't do nothing but just lay there on the floor and look cute, like, I would look at it. I wouldn't hold it or anything. I will look at it and be like, oh, you're so cute. You're so cute. <laughs> okay, you know, like that. But when this cat got to the point to where this cat could jump, all hell to the no, nah, that cat had to go, okay? It was doing too much. And yes, of course, I knew that eventually a cat would jump, but I tried. That was my whole thing I was gonna try. So this time, Candace talked me into a hamster, okay? I don't know where this hamster came from. I sure as hell didn't buy no damn hamster, all right? <laughs> would have got out of that I wouldn't have did it I don't know who gave her this hamster the hamster had like this ball or whatever right and the hamster was in it and this ball be rolling around in the um in the living room and stuff like that like it was a mess like this hamster kept getting out at first we had a German Shepherd at that time and the German Shepherd had caught the hamster and had the hamster in her mouth and I hit the hit the German Shepherd on the head. I was like, oh, no! Popped him on the, it popped her on the head, and she opened her mouth, and the hamster came running out. Like this hamster right here, okay, was doing too much, way too much. And remember, I'm scared. Like I'm scared of the hamster, but I was gonna try to deal with it because it was in that ball behind the hill. This camp, this hamster kept getting out. I don't know. I mean, it had we had a cage or something whatever it was that it belonged in or whatever we had that as well i guess that's what it kept getting out of but again it was just doing too much okay like there was a time where i was getting ready for work it's like six o'clock in the morning and i'm freaking in my closet oh let me back up okay let me give y'all candace and dewan's side to the story candace and dewan are my kids in case you don't know okay i'm gonna give you their side the hamster got out, okay? And Dewan was like, I'm not fixing to tell mom that this hamster is lost because mom is gonna flip and that's your hamster, that's your pet, you need to tell her. Candace was like, oh, hell no, I'm always in trouble. 
and she was i'm always in trouble and mom is going to like literally freaking kill me if she finds out that this hamster got out and she was right y'all okay but the thing of it is is that y'all didn't tell me though okay so when i'm in my room trying to get ready for work minding my own damn business okay and i'm in my closet and i'm like i got clothes on the floor and shit and i'm looking i'm bending over looking ass all up in the air and all of that and i saw this hamster in my closet y'all i lost it i flipped it started running towards me this hamster knew i didn't like it this hamster was coming for your girl that morning i screamed bloody mary yeah bloody mary yeah i screamed the hell out that's what i did okay the kids woke up they're like mom what is going on i was like oh my god that hamster that hamster i saw that hamster and they're like no 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 it's not the hamster mom you tripping this and that and everybody thought i was tripping or whatever so that played out right now from their story their side of the story is that they're sitting there watching tv in the living room one day and they see the hamster run by the tv oh hell no suppose that was me Suppose I had my company over and there's a freaking rat running around, okay? I, to me, it was a rat. Like, to me, it was a rat. Back in my day and stuff, like, we didn't have no rats or no hamsters as no pets, okay? Y'all got a headache. We didn't have no rats or no hamsters or anything like that as no pets. So, to me, that was a straight up freaking rat running around my apartment that was costing me a lot of some money okay all right so in t ways all right so one day candace was at her friend's house her friend's apartment her friend's house whatever it was and me and Dewan was at home and i saw the fucking rat running around my kitchen y'all i saw it running in the kitchen on the floor i screamed again oh my god i screamed ah! oh my god i tried to jump up on the counter all of that okay reese is looking at me like she is so extra right now hey <laughs> i was extra that day i so i have to let y'all know what's up how it went like okay so Dewan comes running in the room and he's like mom what is wrong what happened what's wrong and I was like Dewan I saw that hamster I saw that rat is running around it's loose oh my god I can't stay in the apartment and this I was like please get it please get it get that hamster for me Dewan get it for mama please you know a son a boy he's gonna do whatever he can or whatever he has to do to like help his mom like to help me out of this dilemma and help me from like not like just actually falling out in the middle of the kitchen floor like he had to help his mom so he tried all i remember is that i grabbed or he no he grabbed the refrigerator <laughs> It ran by the refrigerator. <laughs> I grab I I did I I I'm thinking that I did it, that I pulled the refrigerator, but I was so fucking scared. I can't see myself doing that. So I'm gonna say it was D1 that pulled the refrigerator back, right? And we're trying to get get it, get it. I got the broom. Yeah, I'm the one with the broom. I got the broom. Get it, get it. Oh my god. It was like this big fucking dilemma, y'all. Like it was crazy. It was hectic. The dog was running around crazy. Like, what the hell is going on? Like, right? So, all of a sudden, we moved. It went back up under the refrigerator. And we moved the refrigerator again. And when we moved it, we saw the hamster on the floor. Dead. Bleeding. Dead. I was like, oh. 
Oh my God, Candace is going to kill me. I just killed my daughter's baby. Dewan was like, oh my God, mom, Candace is gonna be so upset. We were like, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Y'all, I was so, I felt so, so bad. Like, we just sat up here and fucking killed my daughter's hamster. Like, what am I gonna say when she comes home and she's looking for her freaking hamster, okay? Oh my God. So Dewan got the hamster. I don't even remember what he did with it. I should have called him and asked him before I told y'all this story. But Dewan got the hamster and got rid of the hamster. And when Candace came home, we just tried to play it off. Blocking the door. <laughs> hi, hi Candace, how's your day? Oh yeah, 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 don't go in there, you know. <laughs> yeah, it was, I don't know, it's still running around somewhere, you know. I, 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 I don't know, you know. Gosh. <laughs> Y'all, this is the story behind how I killed my daughter's pet. <sighs> y'all like i feel like i needed to go to prison for murder like for real oh my god i felt like like i was a murderer i was a straight up murderer and candace said later on in life she said she know we did something she said, y'all did something with my hamster. Oh my gosh, y'all. Oh my gosh. So let me know if anything like this has ever happened to y'all. Let me know if you can understand how I must have felt. Like I can't even express enough how bad I found I felt. I could not believe, I mean, no, I didn't like the hamster, but I wasn't trying to kill it either, you know? Like, that was devastating. Yeah, it was. But anyways, if you like these story times so far, please let me know in the comments below. And I'm gonna come, I'm, regardless, I'm coming out with another one on Friday. This might just be the kicker for y'all, I don't know. <laughs> If I want to tell y'all this story, but yeah, so stay tuned for that. Y'all got to run over there right now to go check out Miss AC's channel. Go look and see what she talking about on her story time. Cause she has some real juicy ass shit that happened on Monday that she told us about on Monday. Okay. How she almost freaking got kidnapped, escaping and running away with her bad self. <laughs> remind me of me at that age but all right y'all thank y'all so much for watching i appreciate y'all i love y'all again if you haven't subscribed please go do please do so and please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up i appreciate y'all deuces Mwah.